Final Gamer here, and today we are playing a little bit of Alicia Online. I don't know if it's actually pronounced Alicia or Alicia. Uh, I just say Alicia. I don't know. Um, so I've played this game for well, I've had this game for about a year, maybe. I've recently gotten back into it. Um, before we get into any kind of racing, I would like to show off a couple of things that some people may not know um because i've raced with i recently got my one of my friends into playing the game and there were a couple of things that she didn't know that i got that i got off right uh, that i got right off the bat so i thought i'd just do a quick little tutorial video before i do anything with racing so first things first go to the top right and click on bonus um and my game is frozen Game! Uh oh. Oh, I've broken it. Oh, I've broken it in less than a minute. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> it's fixed itself. Okay. So, in the bonus area, it, you can get a free um, horse equipment, dress, and care package. Um, I usually just get the care package and the star knight equipment just because why not i'm cheapo i don't buy stuff from the shop except for my girls clothes because those are permanent i don't get the 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 the, the. i don't get horse equipment from the store i i'm cheapo um then over here i forgot to do this daily quests as you can see I've already completed all of the main stuff um actually we're gonna pop over here and do it with all the horses walking around oh no snow's dirty oh for snow I'll have to clean her later um with daily quests some people don't know I didn't know this there's you can get you can do them for horse XP or carrots I usually go for carrots because carrots they're a little bit harder to get xp it's just whatever probably pretty it, it's pretty easy to grab um i actually recently learned that if you do a couple different combinations uh, certain combinations you actually get gems which can be used to purchase or slots i did not know that i just usually do the magic team um the racing experience and the magic single because why not they give the most carrots I don't remember off the top of my head what combination of stuff to do to get the gems. Um, so I'm brain farting. While I'm doing that, um, one other way to get carrots that I, well, one main way to get carrots is breeding. You unlock breeding at level 10. And one, well, uh, three of the best, mo uh, three of the most sought after coats is. The black, the white, and the amber gray, I think. For me, black was the hardest to get. White, I got pretty easy. I'm still hoping for an amber gray. I do have a black sab, and he's pretty cool. I kind of want the dapple bay, because da dapple bay is pretty cute. Um, I don't remember what the melee bay looks like. I think that one looks more like, um, um, uh, like a donkey, I guess. Um, let's take snow off of breeding. Because, oh, jeez. Thank you, Snow. I didn't think anybody would breed here that much. I really didn't, because nobody really bred to December. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, Snow. Anyways. So, yeah, as you just saw, I just got... I got a bunch of carrots for putting my girl up for breeding. That was just for a day. That's, like, that's insane. Oh, so happy. I can spend it all on breeding. Ah, well, there's Behemoth. Now, he's named Behemoth for a reason. We'll get into that later. Um, another thing is, um, horse size. When I started the game, I figured horse size would just be based on the size of your character, so I made myself pretty small. Oh, there's River. She's my smallest horse. But that's not true at all. Um, I guess horse size is... I don't know, it's randomized, you can, the weight will tell you how big your horse is. Behemoth, he is my biggest, I don't think I've seen anybody with a bigger horse than he is. I don't know, maybe there is somebody, but I don't 
I've never. I, I hope. To, I would love to meet somebody who has a bigger horse than Behemoth. That would be amazing. Because right now, from what I know, he's he's the biggest horse ever. Maybe I don't know. He's the biggest horse that I've seen. I've had friends that have horses close to his height, but none that were bigger. Um. There are two types of races in this game. There is speed and then there's magic. I am a magic racer, so I have all control horses. For people who don't play the game, um, this will be explained a little bit more easily. In control, um, when you're in racing, there is a, um, a horseshoe that appears right here in the bottom left. And in magic, that bar will slowly go up depending on your horse's control. And when you do jumps, it fills up faster. So, horses with higher control, that bar fills up faster, and well, speed racers are explanatory, are kind of explanatory. You just want speed, you want speed all the way, and oh, the freezing. Um, and yeah, um, usually with speed, you just want pure speed horses, and you just go. I'm not a speed racer. I don't like speed. Uh. My friend, she likes speed, so I'm working towards, once I get my Amber Cream baby, I'm going to work on getting a speed horse so I can speed race with her better. But for now, I think I'll just stick with magic. I'm not much of a, like I said, not much of speed. I don't, speed stupid to me. <laughs> well, not stupid, but it, it just feels boring. Um. Oh, yeah. This is one thing I figured out. Really quickly, um, when breeding, the highest grade a horse can be for breeding is grade eights. So if you've noticed, I've kept Behemoth with his total stats at 179, as well as Snow and December. Oh, oh, December has one point sequencer. Oh, that's awesome. Um, so yeah, once horses reach total stats of 180 or wait. Yeah, 180 or higher, they are, they they grade up, they'll go grade 9, and you can't put them up for breeding. But you can breed them with other horses, but you can't put them up for breeding for other people to breed too. Which kind of sucks, but I get it. Um, if you guys don't like the spiky mane, something's wrong with you. The spiky mane's the best. I want a spiky mane army. I have two right now. This, oh jeez, uh, lag, uh, why? Uh. Um... Uh, December was my first white horse, and I got snow, I think, yesterday, or the day before, and I'm, I'm really sad because <laughs> it took me forever to get my first black horse, and the stats were amazing, and then it took even, well, yeah, and it took even longer to get it with the spiky mane, and still the stats were pretty good. I think the horses I read into that had 90 control or higher in my horses, They've ha they have, well, River is max, she has 120, uh, control, but I don't, I think she had like 90 something when I was breeding her to get Rarity and Behemoth. Um, so when I was breeding, I think I used, I think I used Rarity to get December, and then I used Behemoth and got Snow. Hang on. Yep. Oh, jeez. Uh, sorry. Yeah, I did. I used Rarity and I got December. Oh, but December didn't have the spike me, which sucks. But she got the curly tail. And then Snow, I used Behemoth. And she got the spiky mane, thankfully. But she got the long thick tail, which is fine. I don't really care about tails. As long as they're not the nub and as long as they're not short, I don't care. Um, I guess that's it for this quick little tutorial. Unless I missed something. Oh, right, one last thing. Um, let's go to player profile. All kinds of lag. Alright. Achievements. It's usually not this laggy for me. I wonder if it's because I'm recording. Um, so. There are victory poses that you can get for completing certain, um. Uh, certain achievements. I have one. I think the other is. Yep, it's this one. This wasp will give you a victory pose, and I think there's one in Warrior. That gives you a victory pose. You unlock more booklets as you as you as you age, <laughs> as you level. 
Your horses level, and then you level your character levels. Um, there's your character level, and then your horse levels are your classes, your class ups. Um, gems are a, a kind of a rare in-game currency. There is, I think there's, well, there's two ways to get it actually. There is the there's carnivals, and then there's I guess the daily quests. I don't know if you can actually buy them with money. I don't think you can. Um, and carrots is the main thing you use, that's your main currency, you use that for breeding and purchasing and all that good stuff. Um, what else? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, also, if you have not done this already, do the tutorials. When you complete them, you get carrots, and that's good. You want carrots, you need them. So then there's the magic tutorial and there's speed tutorial. I think speed tutorial is the longer one. Or maybe they're the same like that, I don't know. Um, so yeah, um, I think that's it. Alright, uh, we'll see you guys in the next race. Where's my mouse? Bye!